Uh-huh. So that's why I started the uh, post the uh, master hysterectomy. Right. And uh, I will show you later the tympanic membrane, which is uh, uh, strongly lateralized. So yes. we cannot do uh, osteoplasty in this case. It's a difficult problem. And uh, we plan to to do some uh, VSB setting on the uh, stapes with a clip coupler. So you have a, a stapes that is yes, standing Yes, I think the stapes is present. And is is mobile. But, uh, yes, I think I think so. Why do you think so? Imaging. Um, we have a good imaging with this scan uh, that shows a nice uh, stapes. So of course. Uh, in case uh, I have also a old window, uh, run window coupler. Okay, if it is fixed. So, but it's a good indication because uh, the, uh, the bone conduction is a uh, ski sloping, but uh, the air conduction is profound with a maximum conducting Higgins loss. Okay, so what's uh, what's the bone? For the two kilohertz, do you know by heart? Excuse me. What's the bone conduction threshold for for the two kilohertz? Oh uh, yes, the bone conduction threshold uh, minus forty. Minus forty. So it's it's the uh, upper limit for yeah. vibrant sound bridge, yeah. okay. but I think uh, we can achieve a good result. From now, there is no real pneumatization. Yeah, it looks very sclerotic. Yes. And also on the CT scan, we can see that uh, there is a precedent uh, of sinus. So, let's continue. Okay, ça c'est en dessous. Okay, continue. So for the beginners, when there is no optimization, just follow the uh, dura on the, the uh, anterior part of the mastoidectomy in this region. And then we just to find the uh, antrum. Okay. Of course, we have to uh, keep a little bit, little bit uh, bone of the dura here. Okay, tenez, tenez voir ça. Okay, let's continue. Go ahead. Well, it's quite
quite dense, isn't it? Okay, so just a little bit boring, this uh, stage of the surgery, but, but it's anyway. It's necessary to do <laughs> anyway, so. It's the right side, yes, right surgery. Okay, press down two. Okay. So next we'll find the uh, antrum here. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, this is real life. It is. I remember a demonstration I once gave in uh, in Argentina on a head, and I, there was not a single air cell okay. oh. before before oh. I reached the post imp. Not a single one. It was yeah, well, nightmarish, but well, it, it, yeah, no, it was it was a head. Yeah, fortunately, but I just finished in time, but it was um, a race. Okay. <laughs> That's a head you won't break easily if you <laughs> if you knock on it. So also what you can see here is the bulging of the dura, which is really common in this yeah. area. Yeah. And once you are Deeper, it's okay. Is this a lady or a man? This patient. Uh, a female. Female, yeah. A hard headed female. Yes. Okay, let's zoom a little bit. Uh -huh. Just continue like this. There's no other option, you have to get through. No. But I, I suppose you had a CT scan of these patients? Did you? Excuse me? I suppose uh, I, I didn't had, understand. I suppose you had a CT scan of this of this patient. Uh, a CT scan. Cat. Did you have a image? Of course, yes. So you have a CT scan, and uh, so you, knew you have also was some uh, yes, some images on the uh, slides. I just uh, gave uh, last week to Robert Vincent. Uh -huh. So you you should see a few. Uh, Sections no, on the axial see. view. No, yes. So you you knew you know beforehand what was what was waiting for you, right? Yes, I knew it. Yes. Yeah. Did you select the case yourself, or did someone friendly selected it for you? <laughs> no, I selected these patients myself. Yes. Ah, uh, well, on you're purpose. doing it. Your, well, yeah. there's, a name, there's a name for that. It's called masochism. Yes. Definitely. And you have the bad luck that you're, you know, the, only, you're the only surgeon who is active at, at the moment on, on channel okay. 2. So we, we have to stick with you and see you suffer and hear the sigh and watch your work. 
Okay, thank you. So just to tell you the, the story about uh, Grenoble, we started a vibrant sandwich implant in 97. And uh, this morning, uh, before my first patient with, with you, I did uh, exploitation of uh, VSB and uh, CIE. And uh, this was a female patient that underwent her first surgery in uh, 2000. But of course, after uh, 18 years, she continued to uh, decrease her hearing, and finally, uh, I put a CI this morning. Uh -huh. So this is just to tell you that uh, this kind of implant is a really robust one. On the long term, you can achieve good results. But well, uh -huh. of course, in some times, the uh, hearing continues to decrease with the patient, and then, and then out of the, the solution is so, a yeah. CI. Yes. yes. So we should find very soon the antrum here? Well, we hope so. No, soon. <laughs> Don't make any predictions, because if you make predictions, then Murphy will come in. So it's better not to say anything. <laughs> just, just drill on, drill on until you're there. Yes, okay. Good advice. Well, based on experience, man. Yes, thank you. <laughs> okay, so I've just exposed like this now. Okay, last. I just need to compress a little bit my Jura here. Hmm? Why? Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, too. Is that okay? Okay, the phrase. Okay. Okay, we're getting there, I see. Yes. Okay. Okay. Ok, Fred, euh, taille en dessous maintenant. 
And the next uh, slot over there, green one, the green. Okay, thank you. Okay. For the metro, a bit long. Huh? Uh, no, this is too dangerous. Not this one. Give me another uh, cutting burr. That's aggressive. That's an aggressive burr you're using there, right? Yes, it's a small one, yes. So in a case like this, Sebastian, your advice would be to stay close to the tegment, wouldn't it? To find the um, the first cell. Okay. Much better. Uh, water, please. So in a case like this, your advice would be to stay close to the tagman to approach... Hello, if you play. Okay, we need to... So we find our landmarks and now I can drill safely in this area. Okay. So okay. What, what, uh, di what did steps? you see, no, okay. Marks? Uh, can can okay. you see something? Okay, give me a four steps. That's Roku, four steps. So I think there is still uh, an increase remaining, but there is no contact with the stapes, of course. Why? Why would that be? That's four. Yeah, you, why? Why do you think there is no contact with the stapes? Have you seen that on imaging, or? In France, we have now reimbursement for this kind of implant, middle implant, but only in case of conductive hearing loss, not in pure sensory hearing loss. Mm -hmm. So these patients will have a reimbursement. Aren't you afraid of this uh, cutting cutting burr so close to the chain, Sebastian? Okay, there is four passing my four. S'il vous plaît. What's this? I thought this was the increase, but I'm not sure. But it moves. 
Yes, it was. I think so. 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 Okay. okay. Was it the Incus? This was yes, such a remnant of the Incus. Of the Incus, and the long process was. And the reason it. I removed it is just to have a better view of the lateral semicircular canal. Okay. And, and the second uh, portion of the facial nerve. And I you were sure that there was no connection. Which should with the be here. Or? And the lateral canal should be here in this area. Okay. Oui. Okay, let's continue. I don't usually uh, not use facial neural monitoring, but I did in this case, in some uh, special cases like this, I think it's uh, real valuable. Okay. Okay, continue here. Okay, uh, grand crochet. So, uh, as I said, uh, there is no uh, continuity between the uh, ossicles. And uh, just before, I think there was some uh, osseous reconstruction, and this is the incus, which is uh, mobile. So it's when not, you decide it's not, it's for not very, it's not very clear. continuous circular chain and the VSB, the best option is to do just a AP tamponotomy like this and to put a uh, short process of the incus coupler and uh, doing so it can be a 30 minutes procedure. Okay. Uh, yes. So I could remove the incus but I will do it later. Just continue my uh, so anatomy now. What what you took out was not the incus before. Hello, Sebastian. Do you hear me, Sebastian? Hello. Hello. Okay. Sebastian, do you hear me? Un peu plus long la fraise. A bit longer.
<laughs> Hello, do you hear me? Not too bad. Seb Sebastian. Hello. Hello. Here, if you are really lost, you need to find the Corda Timpani. But of Hello. course, now Sebastian. we have Hello, all Sebastian. our landmarks, the lateral canal, the incus, Hello. the trajectory of the facial nerve also. Okay. We can see this uh, Posterior external auditory canal. Okay. I don't think that this is the facial nerve here. It's just a cell of the uh, facial recess. Okay. Ok, diamant. Bon, oui.
Okay, the dummy. Type it off. Ready. Now we check. Uh, uh, Le Rouvier. OK. L'instant. Implant. Good side. OK. That's good. Euh, ça, presque coupante, euh, la taille numéro 2, la deuxième en plus grosse. So now just to drill a little, bit, little groove, and then we screw the implant. Okay. Bien monté. Bon. Allez, diamant, diamant. Ok. Ok, la fraise. Time to again. So here everything has to be very smooth in order not to uh, damage the lead. Okay, water. Une pince, on va enlever le dummy. Implant. What's up? Okay, so we change our gloves. And then we put the implant, go. Okay. Guys, okay. Uh, for a buff.
Okay, this way will be just fine. Okay. Uh, So, okay, uh, Aspiras, uh, no, uh, Hello, uh, Sebastian, can you hear us? Uh, yes, yes, we can hear you. No, no, father. Okay, so. Okay, okay, so just uh, now I will put the two screws, at least one of the two. Turn it, Okay. Pass me pass my gauche. Okay. So this is number one, and then number two. Uh, in some cases, one is enough. It will not move anymore. Just, I just want to to turn it like this. Okay. Please hold it. So second screw. Just to to remember that there are three screws. One which is the uh, safety screw, which is also longer than the two others. Okay, this is it. Number one, number two. Okay. The link. Okay. Fathers. Okay. The two screws. Aspiration. Yep. Here. And second one here. Okay, so now give me the uh, clip coupler, the clip. Okay, give me some water. Copper. Oui. Aspirateur plus fin. No, that's okay. But just a diamond burr, a big one. Yes, diamond burr. Okay. Water again.
In auditory implants, we take a lot of time to wash, to clean. It's very important. Okay. So now give me some uh, wax. Vax? Vax. Okay. No, this is too big. Small one. Half. Half size. Okay, please. Okay, that's good. So you just put it here, like this. Yeah, bon, on avec? Okay, now the clip coupler. So there is two ways to to use the clip coupler. Okay. So what happened to that coupler? Uh, Tony. Uh, yes. Okay. Uh, la four. Can you hear us? Yes. Yes. We can hear you. We're watching. Okay, so by doing so, uh, pince coco, forceps, then you take it like this, What? This is a wedding. But sometimes it can be tricky. Okay. That's it. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. I don't know if you can hear me, but anyway, I uh, yes, we I can go hear on. you. Yeah, we can hear.
or I think there is some problem with the with the copra. Yes, there it is. It's one of the legs bent. Okay, uh, give me another one. Yes. I need a newer one. Because here there is some problem with it. Okay? Right? Okay, pince coco. I don't know if I can fix it this way, otherwise I use a new one. Yes, okay. I think there was a bending of the uh, titanium arms yeah, one, one of the while pushing on the vax. Okay, I will do it in this way. Should be okay. I make a new try. Yes, yeah, a little bit better, but the fight is not optimal. Okay. Uh, Let's see if we can go to my gauche. If you want, yeah. Why not? Yeah. Okay. Okay, now give me a new couple. A new one, yes, please. Okay. So this was the first way to marry the couple and the FMT externally. And now the second way